I rise today, Mr. Speaker, to commemorate the 2015 March for Life, appropriately themed, Every Life is a Gift. Life begins at conception and must be defended at every stage, whether for the unborn, the disabled, the elderly, we must promote a culture of life. This can and must be done through our public policy that is made here in Washington, D.C., just as it's being done throughout the country in our communities. Across the country, there are many places, thousands of pro-life pregnancy centers, places like Choices Pregnancy Services in Western Pennsylvania, which does important work helping families say yes to life by offering free medical and counseling services and helping women in need. As we prepare to march tomorrow on the anniversary of Roe versus Wade, a decision that the late Justice Byron White described as an exercise in raw judicial power, I urge my colleagues to join me in committing to defend the sanctity of life. I also ask my colleagues to join me in supporting the pain-capable Unborn Child Protection Act. I thank the speaker and I yield back to the gentleman. Thank you very much. Uh, I want to thank Mr. Rothfuss for, for not only his statement today, but he has been a, a true rising star and a leader in defending the sanctity of life. Thank you very much.